Today we're focusing on cancer immunotherapy. It's a breakthrough in cancer treatment, but surrounded by myths that we'll debunk today. Let's get started. Myth one, the idea that immunotherapy can replace all other cancer treatments like chemotherapy or radiation. Immunotherapy is indeed a groundbreaking advancement and works by boosting the body's immune system to fight cancer. However, it's not a one-size-fits-all solution. It's most effective when combined with conventional treatments. Each patient's treatment plan is unique and tailored to a specific type of cancer, its progression, and the patient's overall health. Next, we tackle the myth that immunotherapy is effective for all cancer patients. The reality is more complex. While certain cancers like melanoma and lung cancer have seen remarkable responses to immunotherapy, not all cancers or patients respond to it. The effectiveness of immunotherapy can depend on numerous factors, including the cancer's genetic makeup and the patient's immune system health. Ongoing research aims to predict who will benefit most from immunotherapy and why others do not. The third myth is that immunotherapy has no side effects. This isn't true. While generally considered less harsh than chemotherapy, immunotherapy can still cause significant side effects. These include inflammation, autoimmune reactions, and even effects on vital organs. These reactions occur because the immune system, once activated, may also attack healthy cells and tissues. Another common misconception is that immunotherapy provides immediate results. In reality, immunotherapy often requires time to be effective. Some patients may experience benefit only after weeks or months, and the progress can vary greatly. It's a gradual process where the immune system slowly learns to target and kill cancer cells more effectively. Finally, the belief that immunotherapy is a guaranteed cure. While it has indeed resulted in long-term remission for some patients, it is not a universal cure for all cancer types or all patients. The outcomes of immunotherapy can be dramatically different from one individual to another, influenced by the disease stage, the treatment's timing, and individual's immune system responses. In conclusion, immunotherapy is a powerful tool in the fight against cancer, but like any treatment, it has its limitations. It is important for patients and their families to have a realistic understanding of what immunotherapy can and cannot do. Always discuss treatment options with your oncology team to tailor a plan that fits your specific needs. If you found this video helpful, drop your questions or experiences in the comments below. We'd love to hear from you.